Hello and welcome to my channel. Um, first things first, introduction maybe. I think that's kind of what you're supposed to do. I don't know. Um, my name is Sarah and I usually go by the name of Ray because I feel more comfortable with it. Videos like this are something um, I've wanted to do for like forever and I've never had like the courage to actually do it before and lately I've been thinking that maybe I don't know fuck it and maybe I should just do it so I'm doing it now um, I'm taking that first big step into the world and I'm trying to do something so excuse me for my wrapped up hair but yeah we're on to something right now okay to continue on the introduction part um, I am 25, oh, soon to be 25 in a few days, so 25-ish, okay? Um, and I live in France, however, I speak English on a daily basis and I'd rather speak English than French. However, you might hear me speak French from time to time. There might be videos where we speak only French because the people around me are French speakers and I cannot make them speak English with me so yeah we do not have a choice in that today you join me in a get ready with me video I have found the perfect angle yeah okay we're good basically what I'm going to do is my skincare routine or at least my skincare not exactly that it is a routine because I don't apply it every day but I'm trying we'll do that and call it a day no, I don't know. Okay, my skin has suffered from very bad and severe anxiety these days, which is why I'm having a day off right now. So yeah, there are dry patches, red patches. Ah, oh, that is terrible. So what we're gonna do is we will start with this product, which is a super jelly cleansing gel for rebalancing skin and refreshing your skin from Beauty Bay, okay? So I'm gonna apply it to my skin, which shall be dry at first, and I will make it sink in with my glorious Foreo. Let's do it. <clears throat> so you wanna apply three pumps, one, two, three, okay? And then smear it across your face, on the cheeks, Ooh, it stinks a bit. Okay, and your forehead. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I can do that here. I need a mirror. That's beautiful. Okay. So the first step is done. Then I'm doing with my forearm. I love that thing. It is such. I don't. I don't know. It's kind of a lifesaver. It works perfectly well, and it does wonders. It lets. It allows the product to sink in into your skin and do its work better than, say, let's say, if you did it with your fingers. So, it works wonders. Yeah. So now it's sinking in. Oh, it vibrates in my skull right now. A mental health day, I think. Not that I'm very um, good at taking care of my mental health these days. Um, I've been under a lot of stress at work and I kind of broke down recently. So yeah, we're trying to do anything that can be helpful. From, that goes from, yeah, writing, watching TV shows or doing these videos <laughs> yeah i think it can be helpful to do something that you like and yeah take a day just for that and um it will help your mind i think oh yeah i think it's enough right now however because i have dry patches right here um in the corners of my nose corners i don't really know 
I'm going to apply just another pump of this really tiny pump and smear it right here and apply it with my fingers so that it help with the dry patches that I have here okay so I've gone with this Beauty Bay product because I wanted to try something new and I've bought it at the same time I've bought my Ethereum on Beauty Bay so I was like why not try another product that could work wonders and it actually does so I don't think I will ever not ever stray away from that product because it leaves my skin to be extremely soft and smooth and not red so I think it works good for me you know but whatever works for you ah. and now on to taking it off you want to apply lukewarm water on that so to smear wipe it off with your hand or I don't think maybe you can use a glove I don't really know I know I just use my bare hands and it works quite good the water doesn't have to be too hot because otherwise you just reveal the dry patches again dry your skin with a towel obviously okay next step in the skincare routine is the serum yeah so it's called the Sothis Paris serum okay ultra lip ultra lipid SOS serum and this hydrates your skin wonderfully I think I, if I didn't have a, dry, a skin as dry as I do, I will only have to use it once a week or something like that. Even with my dry skin, I need to use it every every two days, something like that. And it's really, really nice. It smells nice. And yeah, so three pumps here as well. One, two three and then progress your face now I'm all shiny sometimes due to how dry my skin is I need a few more pumps just to make it just to make sure that we're getting it all off and treated correctly yeah I think I this is one of those days where I need mm. It's one of those days where I need one You see here, around here It's very dry so we need two other pumps One, two A good side point to this is that I will have hydrated hands So all in all, we're all winning I think I can just be a winner in that, in that thing, okay? I think that's good. It smells really nice and I don't know it smells like It reminds me like something of When you a product that you use when you're on vacation uh, that you use in the summer For the Sun Yeah, it reminds me of this. I don't know what's in there, but It is beautiful Here I tend to have a really wide dry patch just here I know you can see it here and it hurts so much around my nose okay yeah and we're good I'm trying this out today which is a Nivea soft uh, hydrating cream fresh sensation so we're trying it out because oh it smells nice it smells like 
those baby products you use that always smells really nice so i'm trying it out because the other one i have i've used for a really long time now and i just wanted to know if that one was working as well and i kind of like this format better than the one tiny pot now on to applying my beautiful cream oh it's soft soft and cool and fresh why not <laughs> i was like we're not putting on too much but i already feel like it's much okay i feel like it's too much because of how i've used a serum that's all with my skin and thereafter i think you don't need to use a lot of cream just to get your skin hydrated okay. that is cool that is nice yeah we're nice and cool okay i finished my hair but i'm not going to brush it the only thing i'm going to brush is my bangs because they're really long right now and Oh, they might need a good cut as well however I don't want to go to the salon right now and I think we can do I think we can manage with the curtain bangs at the moment um, yeah and the reason as to why I'm not actively brushing my hair is because then it will be all it will be sorry I don't know why I keep saying that for this hair yeah so i'm not brushing my hair actively because then they will be all flat it will be it's ah it will be all flat and kind of thick and i don't want that so i'd rather go for a natural uh wavy look which is how i achieve it but we'll be all tied into knots so will still manage i think it was to be pretty yeah and now we're leaving it to dry off by its own and now that you've gotten ready with me i think it's about time that i introduce myself quite properly so i told you my name i told you what age i am but what i haven't told you is what keeps me going technically every day or every other month <laughs> i love to read i love formula one races um i love auto sports and yeah that's just about anything about me really i love dogs as well and i technically am what you could call a writer I love to create stories and I think throughout the upcoming vlogs you might be able to see some of it uh, because I will share with it obviously I will share it with you so yeah I think we could be good in that department and then um, what can I say about me that could be relevant I think I can tell you that I own a blog right now and I have been the owner of that blog for about 10 years right now because when 2023 I think I've started it in 2013 or something and uh, it is called On the Shelf with Ray and I'm going to put a link in the box down below um, and it's about anything that I like really so it goes from clothes to beauty products to race to car races to anything traveling books reading writing some quotes uh home decor just about anything that inspires me every day i'm doing it because i like to write and i love to share these things with people and i did not have any feedback on that for quite some time and I don't think I've ever had any th feedback on that except for my friends that have read the, blo the, the blog and told me that it's quite good however I don't think I have any people following me on that one so I still do it because I like it and I'm not doing it um, as 
frequently as I would love to, but I'm trying to keep up with it and I'm trying to upload on it regularly. It's kind of a challenge really, but I'm doing it, I'm trying, and that's the whole point of it. It's something of a passion that I'm trying to keep up. It takes a lot of work, a lot of time, it's kind of consuming, but I'm doing it, I'm trying, and that's all I can say right now, really. So I think I will leave you to that and I'm coming back on here with other vlogs that I think you might like. So anything you love, if you love books, if you love food, if you love to travel and if you love car races and Formula One, come back here. <laughs> come back here, put a thumbs up under this video if you liked it and subscribe if you want more. Bye!